Hello guys, how you doing? So, I'm going to watch episode 583 of One Piece today and it was really interesting to learn that uh, uh, this island became uh, like this um, because of that fight between um, Akainu and Aokiji so that um, explains uh, why this place is um, like split in half and uh, like one side uh, uh, with everything burning and the other one uh, with everything in ice um, so yeah, that was something that never crossed my mind and I'm really glad that they explained it uh, already uh, but uh, I still uh, hope that they show um, some parts uh, of that fight so uh, I'm pretty sure it was uh, pretty incredible and uh, I mean two of these guys fighting against each other uh, of course it would um, it, it was probably a really epic fight um, but yeah we'll see what they end up uh, showing um, at some point and uh, now I'm um, like uh, more worried about um, what's currently happening at the present time um, and yeah there's uh, like uh, these facilities and uh, uh, Nami and the others just got to this uh, room with uh, a lot of these um, giant giant kids so I also want to know um, what exactly is going on I mean I'm like thinking that uh, uh, they were part of these experiments as well but in the end uh, it's hard to be completely sure um, about uh, this sort of things um, but yeah, it's um, it's nice to see that um, Luffy and the others also um, already like dealt with the other guys who were trying to stop them. So now they know about um, what's uh, happening with the rest of them, and they're now uh, on their way to that cold uh, part. Um, but yeah, really can't wait to see what's going to happen. So hope you guys are ready, and let's start this episode. Also curious about that samurai. He said he's trying to save his son, so that's something to take into consideration. Still have to wait for a lot more explanations. Like to understand what happened before. I can't get enough of uh, Frankie's hairstyle. <laughs> it's so funny. Yeah, this. I actually noticed how the ball made a big sound. Because it's so big. And yeah, that's something I want to know as well. Yeah, some things are starting to look a bit messed up. Which is mostly always the case when experiments are involved, especially with humans. That goes for animals as well, so... Yeah, some of them are really big, and the others are um, small, so still quite big for their size, like. Yeah, I'm not sure about that. Exactly what I just mentioned. I love how Nami literally says what I'm singing. Frozen. <laughs> it's a maker. <laughs> oh, wait. It looks <laughs> pretty close to that drawing. The colors, at least. <laughs> Suddenly, Frankie has a lot of fans. Is he going to make some tricks? <laughs> Oh, 
Oh my god, the stuffed animal! <laughs> oh my god! What the place? <laughs> nice way to trigger him. Who is going to do it? <laughs> really? Even wings? <laughs> that one. I got this guy. <laughs> They're already doing it. But yeah. It's all fun and games, but they still need information. Which is what Nami is trying to do. But she like starting to enjoy it a bit. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> only so many emotions. Yeah, screaming is not going to help. They're coming. <laughs> I love how Frankie just picks Chopper and puts him on his shoulder. They're going to stop them. <laughs> that slap. <laughs> Holy. Okay, that's really far. Ooh. Hmm. <laughs> Can Nami? <laughs> oh my god. I don't know if Nami could make like a bridge with uh, her power. Or maybe Usopp with the plants. But it's really far, so... <laughs> oh, it's actually going to involve his plants? Boaty banana. You can actually make a, a boat like that. Yeah, that's really nice. And he was complaining and then he actually add this. That was a crazy place. <laughs> They're already waiting. Of course, Luffy gets that that spot. So Robin already with that dress on. Still uh, not enough for the place they're going to. <laughs> Ooh. He's going to throw a rock? Holy! <laughs> sure, that's exactly what happened. Is he calling something?
We can talk with him from there. Oh, that's right. I like how the dots are slowly connecting. Wait. It can be a bit confusing, I'm trying to understand it. it. Looks like their boss is not the one in that facility. I actually saw that before. It's not like that. Some different guys. But I wonder if they're still involved with this. Damn. Hmm. She's going to do it. Sick. I wonder what's happening to them. It's not good. Yeah, hopefully they will get out of here at some point. I really don't like this. What's happening? Is that the cloud thingy? Damn. They're believing in them. It's 
so painful. She wants to help, but it's going to be hard right now. I'm pretty sure they're going to try to help them afterwards. Exactly. Okay, that's not a good sign. Why are they calling them sick kids though? Exactly. Damn. And that's so sad. The mood completely changed with this. They're so smart, I mean... And I, I actually like how this is affecting Nami a lot. Shows that she cares. Oh, damn, she wants to do it now. Oh my god, wait! This is also pretty personal to her, right? Wasn't that similar to what... Um, Bellimir did to her? Because Nami was found in the middle of that war, right? And Bellimir saved her. Was that Sanji? It's him! Damn! He is! Oh, and there's Chopper with the Kung Fu! That one looks really funny. Oh, they actually said raccoon. <laughs> That's nice. These kids are pretty smart. Holy... Yeah, Nami just couldn't run anymore. Hmm, I mean, I understand him. <laughs> These kind of moments really makes you like her even more. The beautiful lady. <laughs> See how that works, though.
Hmm. I mean, as long as he's helping, I mean, I guess it works. I mean, they shouldn't have a, a hard time against these ones. I'm not sure about some others who might end up appearing. <laughs> what is Brook doing? <laughs> really? Making snowmen? Oh. Wait, this is another... Oh, it's the... Is that the chest? It's, it's the chest of that guy, right? It has the sword. Yeah, that feels bad. There it is. Oh my god. I still can't believe this, this is actually a thing. Even though there's buggy, so... <laughs> but still, it's like a... Each part moves on its own, like even talks and stuff. So it's like, even though it's all split, um, it's like each of the parts, um, like it can uh, control each of them separately. So I don't know how to say this, but uh, like they, they can even talk. So it's it's different um, from Buggy. Like Buggy can also cut himself up and uh, um, like um, move his body parts as he wants. Uh, but I don't think he can make those parts um, uh, like, talk so uh, it's um, different in that aspect i guess um but yeah i actually really enjoyed um, this episode and uh, it was interesting to see how uh, the mood kept changing because of the circumstances so at the start it was um, all fun and games like with the kids uh, seeing them for the first time and uh, like being all happy about uh, their powers and stuff um but then uh, it became really sad because they uh, they know that uh, they're alone in this place and that there's nothing uh, outside, like in this island. So they really want to get out of here and go back to their parents. Um, so yeah, that was a really sad scene. Um, and uh, I want to believe that the... Um, like, uh, the reason Nami decided to, to help them and uh, why she was so affected uh, was because uh, of what happened with her, right? I'm not too sure if it's specifically related to that moment I was talking about with Bellimir um, fighting her in the middle of that um, of that war and uh, and basically becoming uh, her mother from, uh, from there. Um, or if it was like... A, a different time but i don't know i'm definitely going to check um that episode when uh, they were showing um, that specific moment with uh belly mirror i want to believe that she said those words saying that uh like um not leaving uh any child behind uh in this war or something i don't know like how exactly it said um but yeah i want to believe it was around these lines and it would uh, um explain why she's um like um wanting uh, to help these kids so much um, but yeah, I really like this um, this side of her, and I'm really happy that she decided to um, stop and help them. Uh, but I don't know how that's going to work. So in the end, uh, they are like um, there's a lot of them, and they are quite big. So uh, it's uh, hard to uh, hide them, and like let alone get them um, like to a safe place. Um, but yeah, we'll see what ends up happening. And I mean, I. It just crossed my mind that uh, um, Smoker and uh, Tashigi and the others, basically the G5 branch, uh, they are also um, like about to reach here, so that's going to be another problem. Uh, but yeah, maybe they will be helpful in a way. I mean, I don't know, but uh, I would assume that um, the Navy, or at least this branch, because they are like uh, acting on their own, they're not uh, uh, even going with uh, the Navy's uh, orders, uh, but I want to believe that if Smoker and Tashigi saw uh, these uh, wrongdoings uh, in this place, uh, they would uh, 
like most likely help uh, the kids, right? So even though they are after the straw at pirates, um, I want to believe that they would also not be happy with uh, the ones making the experiments, like uh, uh, specifically these um, these masters. So not too sure if that's going to be the case, but that's what I'm thinking right now. Um, and yeah, there's also that thing about um, the boss, and I was actually thinking that it was uh, that master, like the the one who looks like a ghost. Uh, but it's apparently not like that, so I still don't know a lot about um, what's exactly going on, but uh, it looks like these uh, guys who were uh, trying to get the intruders, so like the straw at pirates, um, they are working for that boss, and it's uh, a totally different guy, so uh, I still need to, um, to see more of this to uh, force things to become uh, more clear. Um, but yeah, I like how they keep showing um, a bit during each episode, or at least they they keep showing more details to like basically um, connect to some of the dots so things become more understandable. Um, so yeah, right now just really can't wait to see what's going to happen during the next episode. So hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this one. And if you did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And you can also join my Discord and my Patreon if you want to get early access to my full reactions. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.